In this short video, we will demonstrate some unique features of the Fiber One U Series cassette and UGuard Fiber Shield, which should aid you in the operation of Fiber One's cassette products. Note that when ordering, each cassette is supplied with a more detailed instruction guide for installing and splicing your network. The U Series Fiber cassette from Fiber One is designed to operate in Fiber One rack and wall mount chassis and outdoor cabinets. Each cassette can terminate up to 12 connectors and can be spliced in the field or supplied as an assembly with pre-terminated stub cable. You will notice that the cassette has a flange on each side of the base. These align with the slide rails in the Fiber One chassis or cabinets, allowing the cassette to slide in or out of the unit, making it easier for the technician to access the connectors. On each side of the cassette are push pins that can engage to the slide rails to secure the cassette. Note that the cassettes fit snugly in the slide rails and engaging the push pins is optional for the user. On the top cover, each adapter position is numbered. The window above the numbers is used for the adhesive label supplied with each cassette to write on to identify fibers for your network. The removable U-Guard fiber shield has finger slots on the sides for removing the U-Guard from the cassette. To remove, simply place your index finger on each side and pull. You will notice that on the black adapter plate, there are push pins on each side. If necessary, the adapter plate can be carefully removed. This would only be needed if the technician needs to inspect or access the connector on the back side of the adapter plate. If the cassette is spliced to the network, be very careful as there will only be a short distance that the face plate can be pulled out of the cassette. Note on the adapter plate that there are flanged posts on both sides. Then on the U-Guard fiber shield, Notice the grooves on the inside of the U-Guard. The top grooves align with the flanged posts on the adapter plate when attaching the U-Guard to the cassette. Also, note the beveled grooves on the bottom of the U-Guard. When attaching the U-Guard to the adapter plate of the cassette, place the U-Guard on a slight downward angle to align the beveled slots first. Then slide the U-Guard on and in an upward motion onto the flanges of the adapter plate locking them into place with the top grooves of the U-Guard. A final tech tip. When attaching the U-Guard to the cassette with jumpers attached, place your fingers in the open end to expand the opening and slide the U-Guard over the jumpers in a sideways motion to cover all of the jumpers at once. Follow the previous instructions to attach the U-Guard to the cassette. When complete, slide the cassette into place in the slide rails of the chassis and secure it with the push pins as desired. For more information, visit our website at fiber1llc.com or contact a technical service representative toll-free at 866-434-8877.